The Shrouded King. He got his people together to draw as much power as he could from his own ding-dang dingity son. Used it to make himself a weapon. Soon as the root showed up, he fired the damn thing. Now the king, he knew what was about to happen, but he didn't tell me. Oh, nobody. okay. This is the name, the nameless king, just not nameless king. Um, the root. No. The other one, yeah. It scorched the whole dim darn dingity world. Burned the dead wood the hell out of there. Killed half his kingdom and twisted the other half. And Undying so king. Unrecognizable. And that's why. He wears a shroud, see? Because he done twisted himself in the process. But he don't want no one to see the mangled deep bits of his face parts. Whoa. I reckon you're the best listener I've done had in years. Heck, you devoured up all my stories like most folks lap up my stew. Uh, I do believe I'm all out of stories. But tell you what. There's a bit of a, a constellation prize. Take this. <laughs> I'm guessing nice. that'll be a might bit more. Thank you, bud. Pity that. Well, you take care What is a now. worn cylinder material? Constellation prize. Oh, wait. The neck was something different? Oh. Ooh, damn. That's a nice necklace. That is a nice necklace. Ooh, excuse me. Mm -hmm. Give that man some stew. I will. Give that man some stew. Traveler. <laughs> Hell yeah. Boom. Goodbye, traveler. Gunslinger. Ooh. Just a straight-up gun class. That's cool. That is cool. That is cool. So if you maxed every class, you would get their passives and, frankly would be like a super, super strong character. Mm -mm. So let's put the trait points in him. Oh, okay. Only 60 trait points. Oh, okay. okay. Interesting. Excuse me. This is what's become of Earth? Warp, we'll have to see what we can do, man. Yeah, it's gonna be rough. This looks like Earth, but somehow worse. Looks like Paris. Oh, never been there. That's cool. Hey. 
Here in America, we probably more equate this to Detroit. Or LA, yeah, LA, these days. That was the first thing I said. What the? So are there entire worlds that I won't get in this playthrough? No, okay. Good. So you can see everything in one playthrough if you just continually re-roll adventure modes. Is that accurate? literally charged me into a corner so I couldn't move. He's just, he just took advantage of this game's bad mechanics. Seriously? Oh my god. They have mobs that are li- oh, okay, that's just rude, dude. Jeez. What a jerk. Oh, that's a chest? I didn't even realize that was a chest. That's some AI right there, I know, right? Wait, is that a oh, that's a boss? Wait, I guess it's an event. It just, it just doesn't stop. There's no attack. Okay. Here I am, like, waiting for an attack to dodge it, and it just doesn't attack. It just runs over you like a truck. Okay. I guess, I guess that's a thing. Despite the bad mechanics, is this game still good, though? Oh, yeah, absolutely. Ton, ton, even the best games have some mechanics that aren't great. Absolutely. 100%. I don't think I've ever played a game where I have zero criticism of it in some regard.
hell was that? Dude, is there like a dude tunneling around or something? I'm not even sure what's going on over there. Mm-hmm. Tracks you when he's. Oh my god, bro. You are kidding. What a jerk. I love it. Alright, where's this underground, bro? Was oh, that him? I think that's him. Okay. Got him. I don't trust this. I don't trust it. I don't trust it. Dad, yeah, I don't trust this. Don't try to be elitist and play it on veteran instead of NM, Dad, at least in your first playthrough. Elitist to play a game on the hardest difficulty? Brother, I don't think you know what that word means. My, my thing can't hit this. How hard a player wants to play a game it does is not does not that, that is not what elitist means <laughs> that is a complete different hey man this is just a way to have fun there is bad frustration and there is good frustration and for me hard games give me good frustration it gets you frustrated and that builds up a tank like in a car it's like filling it with gas and the more you fill that tank the better it feels when you actually beat it and I love that feeling. I chase that dragon. It's one of the reasons I play games on hard difficulty. It's a huge amount of fun to like accomplish something that you've been trying for in some cases hours, you know? Fantastic. All right, let's see what we got. We got a haymaker's ring, increased melee damage by 0.2% for every one point of armor encumbrance. Okay. And I think we got uh, a trait. Handling. Reduces spread and recoil. That's pretty specific. Pretty cool, though. Mm -mm. Yeah, I don't know how to get that, that gun with the fingers, but apparently I need to go and re-roll that world a bunch, because from the sounds of it, that's the exact kind of gun I'm looking for right now. Mm-hmm. What even is an elitist? An elitist is kind of like the opposite of what he said. So somebody choosing to play on a hardest difficulty is not being elitist. Somebody who plays on the hardest difficulty and then tells other people 
Well, you aren't even playing the game if you aren't playing on the hardest difficulty. That's being an elitist. Being elitist is somebody who is generally, or, or in, a, in a position where you're saying that, that being super good at something is like the right way to do it. It's, like, it's almost like a form of gatekeeping. Um, like Corey just said. Yeah, it's, it's like, a, it's like there's lots of different ways to define elitism, but it's basically thinking you're better than other people for choices that you make. It's like the TLDR. Yeah. Yeah. And that could be in anything. That could be saying you're better at them skill-wise, that you're having more fun, or that your your point of view or whatever it is holds more weight. Any of that stuff. Kind of like saying PC Master Race. Yes, that's a joke and a meme these days, but at heart, absolutely. That's very, that's, that's PC Master Race is saying my expensive machine is better than your console. Absolutely. That's like the definition of it. But these days it's a meme, which is a little different. It has, it has become just a meme. It's 15% increase to all damage. Consuming a relic doubles the bonus for 15 seconds. Hmm. That's not bad. I wonder how far you can stack damage with the right stuff. I have to look at that when we're done. And buildings just falling all over the place. Why am I not getting hardened iron? Shouldn't I be getting hardened iron? I'm getting a lot of galvanized still. Oh, probably because our... Did we get this one all the way to Hardened? We'll have to check. We may have a little bit more to go with that. I think we did. Uh, Toy Boy, yeah, I, I, that's that's a good point. Yep. Uh oh. Oh, is that not working? Oh, no. Does that mean there's a hard dude coming in? I'm a little confused by what that weird skitsy graphic is. Okay. It's a glitch in the matrix? Maybe. Man, this world is cool. Looks really good. I really hope we got a waypoint coming up here soon. Oh. Okay. All right, let me go check my gun real quick. How far in the game am I? Uh, I think I'm in the last area. I think I'm in the last area, but I mean, I'm, I don't think I'm done with the game. I still kind of want to unlock other classes and I'll probably do adventure mode and a few things. Um, yeah, I'm still having a lot of fun with it. We're gonna try apocalypse mode, maybe? 
Oh no. You again. All right, let's see what you. Uh, we're good there. Bye. Bye. Uh. Yeah. So you're up to hardened, and you're up to hardened, but I'm not getting hardened. <laughs> um. Huh. I mean, I don't. I shouldn't have to up my melee weapon. That's not. That's that doesn't seem to be a requirement. Hmm. I don't know. That's weird. I think it's because they're not really high enough funny. level. Maybe. So you think it's like raw experience? Maybe. Maybe. I don't have any over here, do I? Well, look at you. Put some galvanized, but that's about it. Might as well buy all don't that. Don't be a stranger, okay? Your clip is broken. That's not good. I'm rooting for you, Ko. Thanks. Found the root of the problem. What's just happened? I feel like I'm not doing any damage on this guy. Don't let Chad boss you around, sit down. Mm. 
So much for all that armor I put on. <laughs> okay, this is it. What goes under? Me? Okay, miss time one of those dodges and you're done. Oh, oh, oh. So this is yet another situation where it's like there's one weird little bug at least with the boss. In this case, I can't summon my guys outside of the fight, which is a huge issue. Yep. Say guys, I gotta go uh, flip a fuse real quick. Back in a sec, and then we're gonna beat this guy. <laughs> yeah.